What is up, ladies and gents? My name is Lurksfail, and welcome back to Tohomon Blue Nuzlocke. When we last left off, I think we kicked the crap out of Green and uh, uh, Surge or whatever. And yeah, I I don't remember much about this game's progression, so I can't really say where we're going. All, well, I know where we're going right now. We're going up to the Cave of Death. Yes, the rock tunnel, as it were. Nobody likes the rock tunnel. Not even the rock tunnel likes the rock tunnel. Oh, wait a second, there's an item here. Have I already gotten this? Yeah, I have. Okay. So there that's a fun thing that I never used to know. The uh this little weird little mark that looks kinda like stitching right here means there's a hidden item there. Not particularly well hidden. Uh, but yeah, and I keep forgetting that because of this is Toho on Blue, you can totally just walk through to or, uh, Toho City. Yeah, Toho City. You can totally just walk through Saffron City, because it allows for a lot of sequence breaking. Which is both the best and worst thing about this game. Because I don't know Fire Red well enough to uh, continually know... Or not continually, but I don't know Fire Red particularly well. So I often get lost, and the tree is totally not here. Okay. Oh yeah, I made some changes to the roster, I think. Saki is on board, I'm not trying to level her up, I just have Flash. I might be completely wrong, and there's a fairly high chance that Rock Tunnel doesn't need Flash anymore because of ROM hacks. Anyway, it looks like we have to fight this. And we also taught uh, my here, Cut, because uh, in case you weren't aware, here's another thing that a lot of Toho hacks do. Make HMs kind of sort of usable. I mean, it's still no, not the best, but it's a decent move nonetheless. It's better than it used to be. Even Flash is like, what, base 70 with 80 accuracy? Like, that's not great, but it's better than not having any damage. Yeah, 70 with 80 accuracy, and I think it might also lower accuracy. I don't know, I think that's how it worked in another world. Okay, so I keep bouncing back and forth here. Let's switch Aya to the front, because she's the lowest leveled. Wearing an Aya shirt right now. It's cool. Oh, I've fought her. When did I do that? Why did I do a lot of things here? If I fought you? Hmm. I... <sighs> this is the problem with my play style, is that I just take too long between... Uh, oh, pressing Alt. Uh, I just take too long between recording sessions and don't actually know who I have and haven't fought. And leading with Aya against the Hiker can be good or bad. And in this case, it's probably worse. Oh, this is level 21. That's actually kind of scary. Uh, Yugi can take it. Yugi, go beat up your friend. It's a good idea. Fucking Yugi. Oh, man. Wow, two whole damage, eh, Suika? Fucking the magnitude. Magnitude eight. Good, good job there, Yugi. All right, how much damage? Okay, I figured as much. Uh, yay, Akko grew to level twenty-five. Yugi got a little bit of experience. Oh, Yugi, can you take on your younger self? Probably. Comet punch. Come on, 10 hits. Well, I mean, 10 hits isn't possible, really, though. Two hits. And I have the worst luck with multi-hit moves, man. Hitting twice. Come on, Yugi. You've got better. You're, you're better than that. Okay, good. That didn't kill. I would have been smacking myself if it didn't. And 573 experience isn't the worst. And that's not much money, but whatever. Anyway, a burn heal. Not worth. Not even worth. Okay, back up the ledge. Yeah, I just don't remember Fire Red's progression enough. Okay, I haven't fought this guy. Man, when did I fight those people? Connor. It's a wriggle. You can take on a wriggle, right, Akko? Man, if you can't take on a wriggle, you're useless. Quick attack. Did nothing. Razor Wind did something, for sure. Okay, OH Gale. Well done, Aya. And a decent chunk of experience for that. Almost half a level. Oh man, another Regal. Oh, I thought that I thought he had Intimidate. That's just D Riggles, right? There's nothing he she, sorry. Making the common mistake there. Okay. And almost there is another Riggle. 
<laughs> Fucking no, of course it wouldn't be. Still don't know what Yum Maze type is, I've never looked that up. I still want to say it's like ground bug or ground poison or some, something along those lines. Well, it's bug, whatever it is. So, that is good. And Akko is level 26. Good job. And that is Bug Catcher Car. Well, good thing we were leaving with Aya there. I just really wish I would... She's totally gonna jump me. She? No, I think that's a he. I think that's a male boy. I think that's a male camper. It's still ambiguous. Okay, no, it's not. It's Drew. Oh, man! Oh, man, Aya. So much. So many. So many. Okay, well. That was not even... That was not even words. Okay. Come on, one shot. Come on, one shot. Okay, well, that's a crit. So one shot either way, but I would kind of prefer you just be able to kill them without crits. What is it this time? It's a Momiji. Alright, nothing terribly scary there. These trainers are all... They're all... Uh, weak. Alright, will this be a Hatate? Oh, he juked me. I thought he was going to bring out a Hatate. Little did I know that I was wrong. It's a Rumia. I keep forgetting that Rumias are actually like surprisingly bulky. I think I've brought. I think I've bemoaned this in another uh, video. But uh, why would you give Aya speed boost? Aya is already fast. It's another moment, Jimmy. All right. We already know we can one shot these things. But yeah, it's. Oh, come on, really now? You're just giving me more speed. More speed that I don't really know. But it's like Aya is rarely, rarely not going to outspeed something. And most of the time, that'll just be another bloody Aya, so there's really no reason why she would need speed boost, because, I mean, if she's against another Aya, then they're both gonna be speed boosting, and nothing's gonna come of it. Ugh. But, whatever. I guess there's not any... There's not really any other abilities that would make sense, I suppose. Oh shit, have I... Have I caught something here? Uh, let me check. Which route is this? This is... Route number... Oh, come on, really. Is there any way of... Oh, wait, right here. Route 9. Have I caught something on Route 9? I haven't, I guess. Okay. Let's go. Let's fight this guy, I guess. I probably already have. Actually, I'm almost willing to say I gar... I I'm almost willing to guarantee it, but... I really don't want to be leaving with Aya. She's not in the greatest of spaces here, or greatest of... I don't even know what I'm trying to say anymore. Wait, have I fought him? Yeah, I have. And I've definitely fought you. Okay! I really can't believe that I haven't caught something here. Did I just flood the catch? I... I don't know. I don't know. I've got a little notepad here with all the catches, but, like, it doesn't have flubbed catches aside from that flubbed Hitate. Oh, well, whatever. We'll catch it. I'll wa re watch the videos at some other point, and if I have already gotten something here, then I will just, uh. I will just release it, or put it in the P box, as it were. Okay, who's my best bet? I imagine Mio is probably our best bet for catching something. Okay, what is it gonna be? It's okay, I've already got one of you. I, I don't need one. Way. Listen to the tapping. Okay. Not Aya, not Aya, not a okay, I've got one of those too. Huh. Well, maybe we won't be getting a catch here. I'm sure that there is... There's four possible things in the original Fire Red. I've got a walkthrough up on my second monitor, now that I have a second monitor. That and a type thing so I can check punches. Alright, well, it looks like this is a Tengu pack. Mmm. <sighs> Stupid alt key existing. How many things use alt? It's a Toki... Oh, fuck. I do not need another flying type. Actually, I think the only flying type I've got right now is uh, Aya. But I really don't need a Tokiko. They're just completely... Completely useless. Let's just throw balls at it. If we don't catch it, big, big deal. It's a Tokiko. No one's going to miss it. 
It's just a subpar bird. Tokiko, Tokiko, come on. You've got to be kidding me. You are level 13. You're not getting a great ball. I will throw three balls at you, and if they don't catch, I'll murder you. Because you're a piece of garbage. Thank you. Alright. Yes, yes, yes. Tokiko's... Oh, well, I mean, we didn't really need to read that Pokedex entry anyway. Got a name for you. Snubbing me of a good catch. Go away, trash. I'm, I am so, I'm so good at this whole nuzlocking thing. You're supposed to name them to feel feels when they inevitably die horribly. I'm just calling them trash. Okay, don't know why I jumped down there, but I did, so... Okay. Go up here, jump down here. Who's leading? Uh, you don't really need the levels, though. Uh, and I can't use Mimian. Like, that trade thing is so dumb, but... Can't use Mimian. Guess we're fighting this girl. Don't you dare patronize me! What? I... Okay. I won't hold back, I'll just kick the crap out of you, Caitlyn. It's a wren. Where did you catch that? I want one of them. I could use a fire type. Yeah, sure. Uh, do I have that steel subtype yet? I'm pretty sure Mommy G gets steel as a subtype at some point, but she doesn't have it now. So she is safe against Ren, who I imagine is ghost fire. Uh, cut. I think cut might be her strongest move. Oh, no, I'm dumb. Okay. Uh, quick attack then. Wet quicks. 40, 60. Uh, quick attack is 40, so it's, yeah, it is 60 power. Plus stab, or not plus stab, that is plus stab, but... I mean, it's better than... <sighs> yeah, yeah, I suppose that was just me being dumb. Go fuck yourself. Just... Oh, the yeah, AI cheat so hard sometimes, man. Well, not even a point in keeping you out right now. You can take this. Yugi, I guess. You can, Yugi can just be our kill switch here. Unbelievable with that. In a confuse ray. Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. I'm sure that it's not going to be too much of a problem. Magnitude. Come on, Yugi. Ugh. Power through you. Confusion, woman. Shadow Punch shouldn't hurt that much. Yeah. Come on! God damn! I am getting really unlucky. Ooh, that's a crit! Mm. This is the luckiest freaking... I've got 50 Super Potions? When did I do that? Why do I have 50 Super Potions? But this is the luckiest Ren I have ever seen. Quick attack spam now, thank you. Like, why are you spamming quick attack now? You should, by all rights, be using Shadow Punch. Pretty sure Shadow Punch is 50, 40 or 50 power guaranteed hit, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm thinking of the right move, and then it's plus stab, so it's better than quick attack, but whatever, AI. You're too much, you little prick. Okay. Well, that was more obnoxious than it needed to be. Heal up Yugi. Okay, fantastic. Man, I'm glad they got rid of these dumb little animations. Yep. And I guess that burn heal that I mocked earlier is gonna come in. Oh, no, no. I've already got burn heals, so... That was indeed completely useless. Oh, oh we've got another route. Awesome. Oh, yeah, I needed a... Here, give me a second. The music is going to stop for a moment. Nine. I'm just trying to keep track of my catches. It was a Tokiko. There we go. Alright. So this is Route 10. I have not caught anything on Route 10. Let us move. <sighs> Probably gonna get a Hatate here. If I remember rightly, it was like four months ago or something crazy like that. But if I remember rightly from my last run, I'm pretty sure the only Pokemon I can catch here that I don't already have is a Hatate, so... Not... I still don't need Hatate particularly much, though. Hatate's an alright poke, but, like... 
I don't know. Psychic Flying's a type, I suppose. Means she's really good against fighting types, but we won't be seeing any. We won't be seeing... Uh, that's not exactly true. But... We won't be seeing any until the fighting dojo. Not any particularly difficult, I don't think. Yeah, here's the Dante. Um... And the fighting, even then, too many Suikas to use a flying type. Suikas just... Suikas are just pains in the ass, and I don't know why I was going into my bag. I want to stun for her. Okay, and Hate is paralyzed. And first turn paralysis. And she's got speed boost. Let us go and throw another Toho Ball at her. Come on, catch! One, two, three. Click. Alright, awesome. Hatate, notably better than a Toho, or than a Tokiko. Hatate, better than a Toho, yep. A newbie Tengu reporter. Doesn't like going out into that world, going out into the world. I know that feel, Hatate. Okay, the names for the Hatate. Just. Now. Oopsies. Probably not. Does not look like the most creative name. Not just shortening her name. It's after uh, Hata from Serkaya Kundomo. Which me reminds me, I should probably rename Aya to Ronko. Just same reason. But we're a little ways away from that. Types of Toho matchup. Yeah, yeah, I know about type matchups, man. I'm not dumb. A nugget is totally useless. Well, yeah, basically. That's uh, me, one of the ever-present. I'm supposed to give you a reward. Here's an Everstone. Oh! I didn't know that. The aids don't actually require you to, uh... Yeah, I know. I did not know that, but evidently one of the changes to to in Tohomon Blue was that the aids don't actually, uh... Don't actually require you to catch a certain number of Pokémon, which is very beneficial for a Nuzlocke. Oh yeah, I suppose I'm using event Pokemon in this run, in case you guys needed to know that. I'm saying this because I'm only allowed- I'm not allowed to, like, buy every single, um... It's a person, very alright. I'm not allowed to buy, like, every single... Uh, what's it called? Every single Pokemon from the casino- or Toho from the casino. But I am allowed to buy one. And I will buy one. I already know what I'm gonna buy. I'm probably gonna buy an Alice and hope to god she doesn't become a Margatroid. Margatroid, complete shit. Uh, perhaps that's a bit harsh. She's fine if you're- she's a sweeper. And sweepers are all well and good in a normal run. But in a Nuzlocke, sweepers have no place. You need, uh, you need tanks. But Alice's, uh, other form is just a really great tank. And I- unfortunately I do need to use Flash here. Alright. And I think I also had like 40 repels or something dumb like that. But I do get a catch here, so before I use the repel, I should probably do that. Probably can get a Suicun here, maybe. Have I not had a Rumia this run? Oh, come on! I remember Kenneth. Kenneth, why? Wow, have I really not had a Rumia this run? It seems really unlikely. No, I guess the only place I could have caught them was Mount Moon, and I got a, uh, I got a, uh, got uh, Kenneth there. But I get a Suica, not the worst, not the bear, not the worst possible catch. Certainly not the best, but well, I mean, in this cave, I imagine the only other thing I could have got here was a Rumia, and it's better than a Rumia, and that shouldn't hurt that bad. No, nope, it didn't. Okay, now we just throw our balls. So, Suica, it's an all right. Oh, don't be a pain in the ass. Poison's not very effective against rock, right? Guess we're gonna find out. If this kills... Okay, no, it didn't even come close. I can hit her again and I won't... Let me check the punch. Uh, yeah, they're all physical, so I actually cannot crit. Let's throw another ball. And then, if this doesn't catch them, we'll hit her again, and hopefully we won't crit. I don't see us critting as a real problem. 
Eh, that'll do literally nothing. Well, not quite literally nothing. Two damage is still something. I've won and lost battles on two damage, so... Okay, did not crit. That is good. Oh, man. Welcome to why Suika's terrible. Well, luckily I got my hits in beforehand. If she had done that before, I could have thrown Paralysize Powder on her. Then that would have been the worst. Alright, so we caught Suika. Pretty cool. Pretty sweet, as it were. Gotta heal up, because we did take some damage, and we're next to a Pokemon Center, so... And we will name her... I am not great with names. This is why I should just use a random... a name randomizer. Sally. What a dumb name. I apologize to all the Sallys in the world. Perhaps not dumb, but a bit lacking in creativity and originality, I suppose. And let's go heal up, because we're right here. No reason not to. I'm stingy with my money, so... Yes, I would love you to heal my Toho back to perfect health. And you know what? I think this recording's been running on for a bit long, so... I will... I think I'll cut it here. And in the next episode, we'll go through the cave. I don't actually know how long this is. This recording's been going. I actually don't time them as I should. But that does it for me. This has been Slark's Fail. I'm going to come back into that cave. Peace out.